that he is a beast. Being one of the more mature guys, he plays a lot of oldie goldies. There's plenty of jokers in this team. Cricket last year to me, Neil Kagram. Today we're joined by Carl Mez. Carl, how are you doing? I'm okay. What about you? Yep, all good. So um, we're going to do a little teammates piece. Carl, you're over with the West Indies squad in England. Um, but before we get into it, um, how have you found being in this fire secure um, environment? Um, it's not very difficult for me. I'm a very quiet person. I don't really go anywhere. Um, so it's pretty normal. It's just a little disappointing that it's my first time to England and I can't really go outside to see what's going on. So then, um, then um, how was the, um, the the decision to come over? Did you, was it, I know you're part of the, at this, at the time of recording, you're part of this, uh, the reserve, the, 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 the reserve 11. Um, was it a difficult decision for you to come over? Um, it took some time. Um, obviously with the whole uh, virus stuff, over in England here, um, really consulting with me when we talk, but it really came down to opportunity and, and being able to be around a test team and learn from it. So uh, despite all the other things, I just took this opportunity to be close to a test team and to learn as much as I could during this period. So then for those that don't know um, a lot about yourself, um, you know, you play for, for Barbados, you're an all-rounder. Uh, would you say your strongest suit is with the bat or with the ball? Well, with the bat, but um, if you follow my career from before, I was a bowling all-rounder in the first couple of years I started. It's only this season, last season, that I started to be a batting all-rounder. Um, but I favor the bat more than the ball. And then who are your heroes growing up? Pardon me. Who were your heroes whilst you were growing up that you kind of? Uh, I really, I really had none. Um, at one point, um, Dwayne Smith, I used to look up to him when I was younger. But obviously, Brian Lara was the standout for me as a batsman. I used to look up to both of those players. And we said you're part of the the reserve team at the moment. Is the end goal in your career to represent West Indies in the full Test team? Yeah, for sure. Um, I'm looking forward for any opportunity if it's presented. Um, I'm here working hard with the team. You know, it's a very good environment, a very high performance environment. Um, so I'm very thankful for it. So any opportunity presented, hopefully I will just take it with both hands. Perfect. Can't wait to to kind of get into the, your insight into into your teammates. Um, let's let's have this discussion now. I would say. Keon Hardy, man, he's going. He's always going. He's like a perfectionist to me. I think he's a very good professional athlete. Uh, very young too, so it's very good for a young professional to be. So, um, I mean, to to him to be working so hard to have a great work ethic. Even like today is off day, he wanted to go and do some stuff. The coach actually had to shut that down. So all the youngsters here who are willing to put in the work but as I said he is a beast when it comes to trying to get everything started. I'm Sunil Ambers, my good friend Sunil Ambers. He's just on time every time, just on time every time. Um, we actually have, we have a DJ here, uh, Shane Darch. He controls the, um, the, the speaker. He and um, Kimar Roach, those guys deal with the music. Well, Kimar, no, um, being one of the more mature guys, he plays a lot of oldie goldies. Um, but um, Shane, he keeps it, you know, a bit modern. Uh, at Shamar, Shamar Brooks, I think the guys were giving a bit of stick about his pants that he was wearing to dinner. A checkered pants. Could be, could be Keon Harden. I think it could be Keon Harden. He tries to be like a superstar. Um, I think he looks up to guys like um, 
Cristiano Ronaldo and um, his favorite footballer from his club, um, Rashford. Yeah, I think, I think he, look, he looks up to those days. So he moved exactly like those days. I guess you could say Shannon, Shannon Gabriel. To me, I think he's very tough. Yeah, especially when he has the ball in his hand. Plenty jokers. Um, I can call from Rim Rifa to Shamar Brooks, um, Jason Holder. There's plenty of jokers in this team. I don't want to blow my own trumpet, but I really think that naturally I have it. Um, it just would be to put in the hard work like the rest. <laughs>